Welcome guys back to Crazy Hands Knitting and Crocheting channel and today we are going to crochet a gorgeous beautiful stitch so it's reversible and I like it so much this stitch you can use as a cover pillow cover cup cozy uh, dish towel and many other things so i'm using a 4.5 millimeters uh, crochet hook and uh, dk yarn the number of stitches has to be divisible by four plus two extra stitches so let's cast on make a slip knot Chain 18 1, 2, 3, 4 So multiple of 4, one more 1, 2, 3, 4 Let's add one more 1, 2, 3, 4 one two three four and i think it's enough one two two extra as i said and now count in the fourth stitch this one the fourth make a double crochet like this now chain three one two three and one more double crochet in the same loop like this chain one and let's count one two three four into the four stitch don't count this one one two three four we are going to repeat double crochet chain three and one more double crochet into the same loop that's how it looks chain one yarn over and repeat again count four and double crochet chain three double crochet double crochet let's repeat one more time chain one one two three four double crochet chain three and double crochet and that's how it looks the first row make a chain one yarn over and into the skip the, this stitch and into the last one make a double crochet here don't finish the double crochet because we are going do not finish it like this we are going to add new yarn new color so pull through two loops and now chain four one two three four and turn now we are going to work with a green yarn find chain three space and find that stitch that we worked in the first uh, row because we are going to 
we insert the hook in the same stitch yarn over and make a double crochet now chain two chain three sorry and yarn over and again into the same stitch of the first row and one more double crochet chain one and now again into the same stitch make a double crochet chain three and one more double crochet into that stitch of previous row like this chain one and repeat double crochet chain three and one more double crochet chain one and repeat for the last time double crochet chain three and one more double crochet chain one that's how it looks and make a double crochet let's count into the second stitch if you count from the bottom yarn over and half double crochet pull the loop here and leave it we are going to return to the to the right side take again the yellow yarn and this is the double crochet stitch then skip one more stitch and insert the hook in the next one and pull the yellow yarn through this loop pull here a little bit and make a chain four now find chain three space of the same color not the green one but the yellow one and repeat the same what we did before this one double crochet chain three and one more double crochet into the same chain three space of yellow color chain one and again find the chain three space and make a double crochet chain three And one more double crochet chain one so the secret or that that you never forget that when you work with a yellow color you always look for yellow chain three space when you work with a 
green color you always look for uh, for the nearest ch green chain three space like this later when you crochet a little bit more you will see uh, the texture a little bit denser you will not see those big holes is what you can see now so the last one double crochet chain three double crochet chain one and go underneath this loop that we will work before and then see you go underneath into the root and then go through this loop that we let open and pull through and make a double crochet then pull tight pull tight 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 you will make a small knot there now take the green color and pull it through the loop and now we are going to work with green color chain four and turn Now let's repeat again. Find the chain three space of green color and make a double crochet in it. Chain three and one more double crochet into the chain three space. Chain one and repeat. So look for that chain three space of green color and make a double crochet chain three and one more double crochet chain one and let's repeat again double crochet into the chain three space chain three and one more double crochet chain one and the last one double crochet chain three and one more double crochet chain one so let's find the second stitch one two three this one the second one it count better from the bottom and make a double crochet pull through two Pull through two. Again, leave a long loop and return to the right side. Find again the double crochet stitch, then skip one and insert into the next. Pull through the yellow yarn and chain four. Now repeat everything from the beginning. Find the chain three space of yellow color. Make a double crochet, chain three. Then one more double crochet into the same chain three space. 
chain one and repeat again don't forget about chain one double crochet chain three double crochet chain one one more space double crochet chain three double crochet chain one oops chain one and repeat one more time chain three double crochet chain one and let's join underneath then through the loop itself pull and make a double crochet now pull tight the green color that's how it looks not dense as a big a big example and now i want to show you how to finish the stitch uh, if you want for example to crochet a cup cozy so that's how it looks make a single crochet only in in previous double crochet stitch then one stitch in chain three space the next stitch into the next double crochet and one more single crochet in, in uh, underneath chain one space so in total four stitches and again into previous double crochet stitch underneath chain three space then one more double crochet and underneath chain one space and last time chain three space double crochet and underneath chain one space that's it um, i like how it looks um, it's not stretchy and really looks perfect for the cup cozy and this is an example that we did uh, thank you so much for watching this tutorial i hope you liked and enjoy and i hope it was useful for you please subscribe and i will see you soon bye